another day. So it is 9.30, kind of late in the morning. I'm going to start cooking breakfast. Everybody is up. And I just, in case you can't tell I'm dewy, I'm glowing. Because I just got off the treadmill. Um, I just walked for a half an hour. Um, and I got about 4,000 steps, maybe 4,100. So that's a good start at 9.30 in the morning. And let's hope I can walk around and do... I don't know, four or five more just before noon? Gosh, wouldn't that be nice? Because then I would be almost done. It's probably a pipe dream. But we'll see how it goes. So I'm about to cook breakfast. Steps good. I did weigh myself this morning and I lost uh, 0.2. So I was 202.2 .2 yesterday and I am 202 today. So that's probably just a little bit of water weight because I'm sure I didn't. Do you know what I'm saying? I don't know. I did stay on my Lose It yesterday. I was 68 calories over, which is pretty darn good. So don't go out there. Please stay in the kitchen. So I'm about to, like I say, cook breakfast, figure out what I'm going to eat, feed the kids the usual, the hubs too. So, well, he's not, you know, Chris. All right, guys, I will see you later. Okay, so this is a lunch. This is the, my freezer meal onion soup pork chops. There are five pork chops in the bag, two for Chris, one for me, and one split amongst the girls with one left in the pan. I've got two cans of green beans split amongst us. There is one cup of dry rice cooked. And then of course I made gravy um, out of the onion soup mix and the delicious pan drippings that were um, left from frying the pork chops. Then I, once the gravy was made and I seared the pork chops first, made the gravy and then put a lid on it and let them kind of simmer in a smothered pork chop fashion. There is um, my chicken stock that I made. It's been in the fridge for like two days and um, I have them in bags of two cups and I'm going to be laying them flat in the freezer to freeze um, kind of one at a time because I don't have a place that's big enough to lay them out for all of them inside the freezer at, at the moment. So this is what we're having for dinner on Tuesday the 7th. So we are going to go ahead and get this ate because it looks stinking yummy, yummy, yummy. All right, so I'm pounding out some more steps on the treadmill. And it turns out when I just do 3.0, mile, you know, three miles an hour, it kills me. But oddly, I can do 2.8 quite comfortably. So I'm house walking in an effort to get the last of my steps in. Um, we just, the kids just had a bath, not me, but we I always take that opportunity to Yep, I know, I just walked through uh, into the dark part of the house. Uh, look, they're, they're trailing me. The kids are, they're on me. Um, but they all got baths. I always take that opportunity to, like, wash my face or put one of them paper tissue masks or whatever on. And I just did a really good scrubbing with baking soda on my face. And so you can just, if you just lather up your hands and dab a little, just sprinkle a little baby baking soda in your hand on top of your lather and lather it up. It makes kind of a little paste and it just buffs your skin amazing. Um, it makes you feel really clean, like it gets all the dirt, the grime and the makeup. Uh, and it doesn't make your skin like super red. It just makes it peaky and like peachy and like skin colored. So, a spider? A spider? Oh, this is stink bug. It's not a spider. It's a crisis. Alright, so it is 10 till 6 in the evening. Everyone just had their bath. Except for me. The kids, you know. Uh, got the kids freshly washed and oiled. Look at this. See that big old long, long curl she has? These big old... She's starting to get some ringlets. And um, I'm hoping everyone's going to be a little sleepier now since it's bath. Um, they've had dinner, they didn't really eat a lot, still like 80% on the table, super clean, 13, 
you know what I'm talking about. Okay, so right now I have about 9,200 steps. And, of course, as you see, I am sitting once again. I was doing some house walking a little earlier with the girls, kind of trailing behind me. That was real cute. I said I was going to get on the treadmill and just, like, knock out, you know, five minutes on the treadmill, which would, you know, like, do a couple hundred steps. Well, as soon as I heard that, or as soon as that was said, Lily jumped on the treadmill and, like, needed, needed to walk. So I put her on it for a little while, hoping that would get her a little tired too. So I'm going to go and housewalk and finish, finish those 10,000 steps. And that's my goal until bedtime. So <laughs> we'll see how that goes. Hey, I am here to do my final update. It is 719 as the computer says, and my phone is really giving me some problems with the microphone. It just wants to be real staticky whenever I record. So sometimes I have to record things two or three times, and I'm just not up for doing this two or three times. And at the end of the day, I'm tired, and so I'm going to go ahead and um, I put the girls in bed at 7 o'clock, kind of like our normal thing. I think we start going to bed at like 10 till, and we're finally in bed at like 5 after, 10 after, you know, it just, it's a process. So <sighs> that's done. I had like 300 more steps that I needed, so I got on the treadmill and knocked those out. Um, I went and I made a ginormous salad. It's got avocado. It's a half a head of lettuce, a whole carrot, like um, all these Italian dressing the packet because I like that so much better. It just, cause it doesn't have the sugar in it. It's so much better. Um, I'm not a sweet person. I'm a savory person. So I just don't care for the sugar so much, but um Got my Netflix on. I'm going to watch, I don't know, season three, episode like eight or nine or something of Spartacus. Um, that's vengeance. That's when they're like, uh, broke away slaves. So it makes me so sad that Andy Whitfield died. It have been so good with him. Anyway, um, I'm just like tired. Tomorrow I'm going to get up. Like my whole week has been as far as like scheduling. Wednesday I'm going to I'm gonna go thrifting. My mom may or may not come with me. Thursday mom and I are gonna go grocery shopping. Friday morning I'm going out to Stan Hewitt to um, plot some geocaching and do some strategy sessions with my staff person and we'll see how that all goes. So I got my step goal today. I know I'm going to be over my calories and I just don't care right now. Um, whatever. <laughs> um, it will be terribly over, but maybe tomorrow morning I'll let you know when it's actually, when the dust actually settles. So, uh, because it keeps counting like calories burned through the day all the way up until like midnight. So it's like not set until like the next morning, whatever. I hate when people say whatever and I'm saying whatever a lot. So I'm just going to wrap this up. Of course, I totally, totally love when you give me a, a thumbs up. I'm working hard to try and do some daily vlogging, has been has, which has been requested. We're going to do this for a little while and see how it goes. And then we may continue or we may not. It just depends on, I don't know how it goes, um, if they're liked or not. So comments down below. Uh, did you do your 10,000 steps or whatever your step goal is? Um, fantastic. All right. I will see you later. Don't forget to click subscribe. Bye.